Good morning, everyone. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, we've got a good two days planned for the four days of gains here with Bitcoin TAF. So be sure to join us. Go to the events tab. You'll always see the events tab. It's got all our future events that we've got planned. There's one for tomorrow and you'll see there's just more coming up all the time. Be plugged in. Make sure that you are on BitcoinTAF.com. There's loads of free information as well the events the blogs from the different products that we have be sure to go read understand a little bit more so bitcoin TAF was founded in 2016 by marius and wendy so i just want to show you here quickly the whole team that we've got going at the moment massive behind the scenes work that we have to do to get everything running and and this is how it all started and this is what i want to show you with mtt where we are now so 2016 it was born and out of this there were so many products hot or not with wendy Trendzig. then it was day trade masters small cappy gains in 2020 and i joined in 2021 and now we've rebranded small cappy gains to MTT. So it's all small cap gains, rebranded to MTT, very similar vision and strategies, but we're trying to always get more, more creative in the offerings that we bring to our, to our members. So that's really where Bitcoin TAF has started. We've been going for a number of years with a really good research and analyst teams behind the scenes. So this morning, I'm going to quickly hand over to Marius. So he's going to give us a, a quick overview regarding Bitcoin and where he sees the market is going for the next cycle. And then we're going to get into a, a nice presentation for MTT, who we are, what we stand for, and a few coin picks and some updates. So, and then a nice big announcement that you've all probably seen that we're going to speak about tomorrow. Nice guest in the house, but we'll get to that at the a little bit late in the show. So over to you quickly, Marius. Thank you. Awesome. That's great. And thank you very much, Ines. Yeah, I'm quickly going to just go through Bitcoin here. And as you can recall, many of you members that were on the call last week, we warned you and we said there's going to be a spike in Ethereum Classic. So we gave that away. And we said, look at that. That's going to do 40, 50, 60%. So I hope people took advantage of that. And that was a really nice spike. And then... You know, about a week ago, we were in this downtrend here and we said, don't worry about this downtrend. This can come down possibly to this level here and possibly to that level there. But when it turns up, you're going to see that the altcoins are going to spike. And you can see that in the MTT report as well, that there are multiple coins here. You know, those coins have made some really big gains. Huh? And uh, there's 50, some 80, really 100. remarkable coins there, 10, 15, 20, 50%. So those coins have now made really great gains. Now, what we do at long-term trade reports, we predict what the market is going to do with an algorithmic uh, analysis. Now, from this line onwards, if you really look at that line there, where it touches there and there, we, we kind of like just standing there and we have to be very, very cautious with what is happening at that line. Now, we believe that it could come down perhaps with a bit of a breakout here, but in the MTT report is a product, there's a chart there, which we call the MTT Gold Oscillator. Now it's called the MH Go. Now, if you look at what that uh, MH Go presents there, it will give you the pathway of what Bitcoin is going to do. And I can't give too much of the information away because unfortunately you know, there's a lot of people that pay for the data, but I can give you a hint is that we are kind of like, yeah, we're gonna stay here just for a day, two, three, and then comes massive gains again. So you really wanna get a hold of that. But so far, Ines, what I see in the data, uh, things are moving in the right direction. You guys have made some fantastic calls. So um, just over to you then. Thank you. Just while you get busy there, remember, guys, this is going to turn upwards here. That's your 20 MA, okay? Mm. This green line is going to turn around here. When this crosses, that's going to be a beautiful thing. All that kind of data is more available in the MTT report. But over to you, Ines. Thanks, Marius. And then, guys, have a look in the chat for any recaps from last week and, and then once you join our social channels you will definitely be able to see where we share them snippets and updates we do share here and there some nice free content so be sure to follow those channels 
and we you will always be in the know of what's happening what we're doing what are we planning and what's the next exciting thing in mtt that we've got coming from a free perspective but also for the members so going to to mtt so we medium term trade crypto reports we provide crypto reports two to three times a week we've got a telegram channel and we communicate to our members every single day to give an update of where we are in the market uh, and what the next cycle is going to play out with the current cycle we're in so we say it's the mtt crypto report is all you need to really grow your crypto portfolio and part of the team we've got myself marius and ryan who's our research analyst and marketing specialist so you'll see a lot of content coming your way and be sure to be on all those channels as i've mentioned and MTT is the perfect sweet, sweet spot. Someone that can't be in front of their computer the whole, whole time to trade, they may be into a second job, and, but you can transition from being into a, a full-time job into trading, and then you can get into all the other products as well. We've got day trades, we've got hollow knots, and then long-term trades. So MTT is really that sweet spot for someone that can't be in front of the computer the whole time and don't want to wait a year or two sometimes for the trades to play out. So we work on a seven to 45 day cycle for these coins to play out. And we really try our best to get those, those coins that's going to outperform Bitcoin as a relative uh, to, to the market. Otherwise you can just put your money in Bitcoin and don't worry about trading. So we need to find those coins that's going to outperform Bitcoin. And we've seen it in the last week, a coin where Bitcoin can go up seven or 8% and just stabilize and do a slow grind to the upside. Some of these coins can do a quick 20, 30, 40. You've seen from last week, Ethereum Classic. If you, if you didn't buy or DCA at those specific levels, you, you would miss a 40, 45, 50% spike. It happens so quickly, you can sleep at night and the next morning you'll wake up and you've actually missed a trade. So it's important to make use of the opportunities because I am seeing from the data and we can maybe have a look at it a little bit later that we've got massive opportunity coming into this market. So the solution that we provide in MTT is we really specialize in NFTs, gaming DAOs, Metaverse, Crosschain, all of those products and coins where they may outperform Bitcoin. We've got interactive weekly Zoom calls, we've got PDF reports. And now recently we finally getting to the stage where we can get these companies, CMOs and CEOs and founders on our calls. So in the future, we're going to get some competitions running for our members specifically, where they can probably win some NFTs or, or uh, access to coins or airdrops. So keep a close eye on that. That's going to be really exciting in the months to come. Let's just have a look at the report for you. You've got your Telegram channel, and that was just a coin that's done 105% in the last 20 days in June into July. So OGN. So this is the report. This was the one actually from last week. We do a write-up of the market and we've got our charts and updates uh, some can analysis and this sp specific algorithm that marius mentioned the mh go which is our gold oscillator tracking the market into the specific cycles and where it's a predictive algorithm where you can go into the next into the future so we can take advantage of technical analysis along with this oscillator and see where it's the best places where the market is going to go and what coins will then relatively outperform. So looking at the total three, and that's what I want to focus on today is we had a pivot because I do time cycle analysis. We had a pivot on the 6th of July and you can really see close to this 6th of July was a sort of a bottoming formation. However, since we reached this head and shoulder pattern, there was a low target. And it weaked a little bit lower. There was a lot of news in the market, but we've got this blank space still in time. But as soon as this and the oscillator also indicates, we may continue go, to go up past a break of that $412 million level in the total three, that's excluding Bitcoin and Ethereum, then you will have a massive spike in altcoins. That's why we're positioning ourselves at the moment and also to take profits. Remember, 
MTT, we need to rotate those profits. Never, never get married to a coin where you think you've got now the magic coin and you're going to hold on to it. Take your profits and we recycle them either at lows or we get into other stronger coins that's going to outperform. There's already three, four coins that are updated yesterday on our members chat. The one that I showed was Origin Finance. And this uh, Matic we discussed on our webinar quite a few weeks ago. And I mentioned to the members, we had this spike, came back, and we're looking at that as a safer re-entry zone. Buy zone, and most of the people saw Matic really leading the pack as well, where they had a quick spike to the upside. Now, there is more targets. T3 was our first target, really. And it did a 56, even week pass to a 73% gain in the last, since the 13th of July. So Matic has really been outperforming. We've updated some future targets. It's finding some support at this level of our third target currently. So with future targets as well in place. So we're going to monitor that very closely, take the profits off the table, and it's going to rotate. It's going to go from Matic. It's going to go to the next coin. It's going to go to something else that we're going to show you today as our next uh, pick. So it's very important to make use of these advantages that you can DCA into specific coins because in a matter of really uh, days, uh, the, the outperformance can start. And then let's quickly have a look at Serum, which was a call from last week. It is finding the support at $1.03 at the moment. It's only had a spike up to 22% thus far. So it's an easy trade where you can put your stop loss uh, at break even, even move it up to get into profits. A break below this 103, probably just wait, take your profits, wait for it to get back into the rebuy zone. But I do think while we're building the support at the moment, all these oscillators and moving averages that Morris is pointing to also are moving to the upside slowly. So all these targets are still in place. It's really looking good. So keep, keep the serum trade. Then we had a look at Joe as well. Joe did a quick 48% spike so far. So I think the, let's, well, it was last week, Tuesday, it was the 12th. So the 12th, we were still in this region before we had the breakout. And you can see we had two, two opportunities to get some profits into T2. And then again, the second target at 48%. Also really moving nicely to the upside and 71%, 43 cents is the next target. Uh, for the members, we'll continue to analyze this uh, to see how this is going to play out within the coming weeks. Remember in our seven to 45 day cycle. Now the next coin that I had from last night, which is actually overnight already broken through, is Gala. Now, Gala is one of my real favorite gaming coins and setups. It's been underperforming for some time. We had it in our community for a while. We can show here, this was a specific point in time where we waited for the breakout. The, it didn't work. The trade setup got invalidated and that was our stop loss. So we waited all the time for this trade to come back into a position where we want to take advantage of Gala again. So if it wicks back, back into the buy zone, very good opportunity for DCAing, or you can wait for this RS flip for a re-entry. And these will be your targets, 36% up to 85% uh, gain towards close to 10 cents. So this is how I'll play it at the moment. Once we really get past a specific break in time above 11 cents, then we'll do some reanalysis because Gala as a future project, it will be one of my top picks going into the next cycle. So that's a really good uh, opportunity that I'm giving away today that Gala will not be a project that's going to fade away. They've got a lot of games, not example like Axie Infinity is just one game in the sector where they specialize in. Gala's got a number of games that people can pull onto the platform. So a really solid project uh, to look at. Then I've mentioned, come to our four days of gains webinar tomorrow. We've got the CMO from KAI tomorrow on the call. So a lot of our Bitcoin TAF community, uh, MTT community, 
are holders of KAI, and we really want to know what is going on behind the scenes, what's the future developments for these projects. And remember, in downwards market where coins go down 90, 95, or 80 percent, these guys that survive these cycles are the players that's going to make it throughout the next cycle. We may see some coins disappear because they're running out of cash flow. But when we see projects that's continuing to build and build and build, those are the kind of companies that we're looking for or projects that will continue to outperform into the future and the next cycles. Then let's just finally have a look at the products. We've got a combo uh, running at the moment for MTT and uh, long-term trades. But if you only want to make advantage of the medium-term trade setups, where we give these uh, cycle analysis. Uh, there's a three months, six months, and 12 months. But if you want to make use of the best combo product that we've got at the moment for the July offering is the combo deal for long-term trade reports and MTT with Marius, which is looking at the longer term view and then MTT, which is in the shorter term view, as we explained. And the, currently the saving of the 12 month is really one of the biggest. And then tomorrow, when there's enough people on the call and we see some of these combo deals coming through, uh, I may still need to twist Marius's arm that we possibly can get a competition running for people that take the 12 months uh, to add a, a one month or three months extra on top of that package. So any current members as well, you want to extend your membership you can do that with a current option as well, and it will just be added. So then, then tomorrow, like I said, we've got our day of chain uh, that we're going to discuss with a CMO. Really amazing project. Uh, they based in Vietnam. Vietnam is the fastest growing, if you go do some research, crypto adoption country globally. So these guys are based in, in that uh, part of the world. And what they're building, if you look at the on the app as well, you've got the staking, but we'll get into the whole ecosystem tomorrow. And then I believe Ryan shared our link tree. There's all our channels. Uh, go and follow our specific YouTube, our Instagram, our Twitter, uh, Facebook, and all of those options that we can really get in touch and, and, and communicate with our uh, public and the uh, future members. So thank you for today. I really appreciate it. These are the times where you will be able to see in the next run life-changing money being made. And obviously, we know from a trend perspective, if anything changes politi politically, and those are the kind of factors that we look at MTT as well. Uh, globally, we look at uh, global factors that may influence price as well. So we know more or less where the cycle is going to go, and but we do have invalidation levels as well. If anything happens at all, all you do, you get out of the coins and you buy at the next low. So we've got those specific levels as well in place. But for now, a break above this 23275 for Bitcoin is a very strong level that we're going to watch for. And then we've got, yeah, we've got, I'm not going to give away the specific levels we've got for Bitcoin currently, but it is looking healthy. So thanks for everyone on the call today. We're really looking forward to seeing you tomorrow. And uh, I don't know, Maurice, is there anything you want to close off with? No, Ines, I think you did a real fantastic job <laughs> here. And I think uh, people just really need to go and have a look at the image go, the oscillator, the indicator that's going to give you like a view. It's kind of like a vision into the future, what can happen with Bitcoin. You cannot trade without that. And then get back into the market. If you're not back in the market, read the report, study that. And more important, bring your buddy, your friend, tomorrow to the same call okay but thank you great call man thank you fantastic thanks everyone have a lovely tuesday and we'll see you all tomorrow keep well